Ryam Redwine. Sir Ryam Redwine was the Lord Commander of the King's Guard under Kings Jaharis I Targaryen and Viserys I Targaryen. Ryam is a knight of legendary reputation. Originally of House Redwine, he serves Viserys I Targaryen as Lord Commander of the King's Guard, as he served Jaharis I before him. House of the Dragon, Season 1. Ryam is present at the Great Council of 101 AC, guarding King Jaharis. Nine years into the reign of King Viserys I Targaryen, Ryam stands guard at a small council meeting at the Red Keep, during which the Triarchy and the Heirs Tournament are discussed. Ryam stands guard at the small council meeting that discusses Prince Daemon Targaryen's actions with the City Watch and the criminals of King's Landing. Ryam watches over the King in the Royal Box during the Heirs Tournament. Ryam is present with his King's Guard brothers at the funeral of Queen Emma and Prince Balon as they are cremated by the dragon Syraxis flames. Ryam escorts Viserys into a small council meeting and places his stone ball down for him on the table. He follows a furious Viserys out of the council chamber after the line of succession is debated. Ryam announces Alicent Hightower to King Viserys in his chambers, when she pays the king a visit to offer her condolences for his wife and son. Ryam guards the king at a small council meeting, during which Damon is reported to have held a celebratory party at a pleasure house on the Street of Silk and is claimed to have dubbed Balon that heir for a day. He protects Viserys in the Great Hall when he confronts his brother Damon about these claims. Ryam draws his sword and moves to block Damon's path when he tries to step toward the king seated on the Iron Throne. Ryam escorts Princess Renera Targaryen to see her father at the shrine to Balerion. He is present with his King's Guard brothers at the ceremony naming Renera as Princess of Dragonstone and heir to the Iron Throne. Five months later, Ryam dies in his sleep from a long illness. He is succeeded as Lord Commander by Sir Harold Westerling, while his place in the King's Guard is granted to Sir Kristen Cole. In the books. In the A Song of Ice and Fire, Sir Ryam Redwine served as Lord Commander of the King's Guard during the reigns of Kings Jaehaerys I Targaryen and Viserys I Targaryen. He also served as Hand of the King for a year during Jaehaerys' reign. He was was considered the greatest knight of his day, being skilled with both sword and lance. He was admired by Sir Duncan the Tall, who recalled him defeating terrible foes. He dueled Sir Clement Crabbe in 98 AC at a tourney to celebrate King Jaehaerys's 50th name day. They broke 30 lances against each other before the king declared them co-champions, which is often called the finest display of jousting in the history of Westeros. He was named Hand of the King following the death of the previous Hand, Septon Barth, in 99 AC. He is considered to be one of the worst Hands in the history of the Seven Kingdoms and was replaced by the king's son and heir, Prince Balon, after less than a year. Ryan died in 105 AC and was replaced as Lord Commander by Sir Harold Westerling. Jon Snow would pretend to be Sir Ryan when he and Rob Stark would play together as children, with Rob pretending to be King Daeron I Targaryen. Bran Stark dreams of becoming a Knight of the King's Guard like Ryan, and Sansa Stark hopes to be saved by Sir Ryan, Florian, and Prince Eamon the Dragon Knight during a nightmare following the Riot of King's Landing. Sir Davos Seaworth is reminded by Maester Pylas that Ryam served poorly as Hand despite his high birth and knighthood, and Peter Baelish sings Ryam's praises to convince Sir Loras Tyrell to join the King's Guard. Jaime Lannister considers himself unworthy to hold a position once held by Ryam. If you like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. See you later, bye bye.